eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lift off. plus 33 seconds. Starship test vehicle number 11 ascending over Starbase in South Texas. One kilometer altitude. We've heard the call out. We're over one kilometer up. Views from the external camera on Starship number 11 looking back towards the Starbase facility in the fog in South Texas. Four kilometers altitude. T plus two minutes, we're getting ready to shut down the first of the three Raptor engines. plus two minutes, 21 seconds. You can see we have shut down the first of the three engines on time as planned. plus three minutes continuing to climb on power of two engines we're past eight kilometers T plus three and a half minutes. You can see with the camera view, we have shut down the second of the three engines as planned. We're now slowly climbing to the final 10 kilometer altitude on the power of the single Raptor engine. Six kilometers altitude. T plus five minutes. We're passing through five kilometers. A nice view from the exterior camera. Showing one of the flaps on the Downrange, Starship test range, vehicle number here. 11. Two kilometers altitude. One kilometer altitude. T plus 545, we've just passed through one kilometer altitude, getting ready for the relay. <laughs> 
We're back with you. As you can see from the uh, frozen camera view, uh, we lost the clock at T plus 5 minutes 49 seconds. Looks like we've had another exciting test of Starship number 11. A reminder again, this is a test series to gather data on entry of the Starship vehicle uh, at subsonic speeds as it comes back to the landing zone. It does appear, though, that uh, another exciting test, as we say, uh, we don't have any good camera views to share with you right now, so with that, we are going to bring the webcast to a close.